back guys um look at the scenery it's a bit different eh I just went for a little explore and yeah found this um mob spawner so I'm gonna might make this the, my house eh my actual you know leave John to have my <sighs> leave John to have the big house let's just make this little uh, bit our house anyways I'll teach you how to make a mob spawner you just oh here I'll show you guys so you go one two three four one two three four one two three four on each corner every corner or every direction I should say I think that's four yeah two three four two three four two three four yeah oh, that's good uh, two three four and then after that you want to dig down I think two or three three uh, yeah. you could even just so I don't spawn and it's easier to like take the torches off as you could tell by my voice I'm a little tired so just be off me so bang bang and then just bang all these just so it's excellent don't want to listen I'm falling asleep so do that There we go. So that's done. After that, you need um, a water source. Oh, well, dig down like a couple more. So I wanna be. I want them to. Like, I want some stairs going down, and then them to drop about three blocks. So underneath the spawner. Actually five here. And then so you sort of like that, boom. They're gonna drop down there and you go down here, boop. And then you just boop boop hit them as they come down. Put a oh, make a slab. <coughs> Pull these chests down first. Day. And we make a bucket bucket of water here yeah. I need two but should oh they cook all the sign for later 
Yeah, mate. Cobblestone slab. Boop. Go down here. Pop a slab like here. And a trap door for the little ones. So, because I can still get through there. So, I need a trap door to make sure they can't. Do I even have enough for them? Surely. Nope. Let's go get some water too. It's pretty simple. They just all fly. Uh, user probably seen it like on other Minecraft YouTubers, but it just yeah. You'll see, you'll see. Let's get some more wood, eh? Oh, birch on will do it. And then... Let's go back and then show you what show you guys what to do make an infinite water source though like right next to it so it's just real easy and then yeah it's pretty much finished your multiple mob spawner let's make on here Then all you do is pour water on every corner and it should flow on like this, like you know. And then you can drop down. Oh, I forgot that was there. See if that was a zombie I couldn't wouldn't be able to get out. But you need a trap door just to make sure the little ones don't get out. There you go. Get some more water. There we go. Then go down. It's a trap door. Boop. Boop. Now you just break all the torches. Oh no. 
That was pretty stupid. Last bucket. Let's put the blue. If I do this, be like, put that there, and then pop, pop, and then go up here. Break the torches. Saying this is easy. Let's pop. XP for days after this. See, there's one already dropped. Jana. Now you gotta quickly break these so don't disrupt the water flow. Blue. There we go. And now you got your own zombie spawner. And they'll be down here, so we'll just walk down here and then free XP for days. Here we go, that's how you make that little mob spawner. Now let's do a bit of the house eh? So cool. stuff but hmm could they just stand here wait for millions to spawn and just get free XP I hope you guys enjoyed the episode I think it was long enough eh I don't know though but at least you learned something today just how to make a spawner Box that off from the light. It can get sort of noisy. <clears throat> I'll just demonstrate it. There we go. And then go down here. Ten level ten. See that nice, nice, quick, easy XP. Mm. Hope you guys enjoyed that episode. <sighs> Pretty tired, eh? So yeah. Just chillin'. Yo, Jana. <laughs>